Hi, I'm James Buckley. I just wanted to share with you a few things. This is my first video for YouTube, and I hope as I get a lot of comments and a lot of views that I'll be able to establish more videos in the near future. But my uh, goal is to be able to come before you, all you YouTube viewers, and just say this. Sometimes in life, you know, we think that all things are rough and everything is rough but I want you to know I've been in a place in my life where I've got and have learned to trust in the Lord when I trust in the Lord I have an opportunity to see him moving in such a way that is only mind boggling to those who don't know the Lord so <clears throat> my first video I just want to introduce myself to you YouTube viewers I do run successful business here at home and it's not about my business right now, it's about uh, me. Me producing myself, presenting myself before the YouTube viewers and just seeing how many comments I get. Oh, my phone's on one more. Hold on, this is my director. I must take this call. Hey, Dion. How's it going? Uh, yes, I do. Uh, let me see. It. No, I think they in, uh, I don't say Arizona. Mountain time, I believe. No, they central time. I remember now. Uh, I was just fooling around here on that YouTube thing. I hadn't got nothing going yet, but let's see. Let me look it up, man. Fine, I, I, I'm looking at in, in my roller. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Yeah, that's my uh, coastal director, Dion Danner. But uh, I am a coastal director and also uh, Traverse Travel and do VM Direct. They all three are great businesses. But just to, I just wanted to share a little bit about myself because in reality, uh, we, we've got to learn that... Uh, Without the Lord, we, we, we can't uh, achieve and accomplish all the, the destiny that he's performed for our life. You know, before the foundations of this world, God has destined us to be a part of what he's designed us to be. And, and in our design, we all are uh, uh, function the way we are because of that design. And so in my understanding of that, I have to... Uh, learn who I am in the Lord. We have an identity crisis within the church today. The identity crisis is uh, one not knowing who they are in the Lord. Therefore, they fall beneath the privileges of where God wants to carry them to the next level of being the uh, one that he's calling to be based on the uh, gifts and the, and the callings that he has upon his life. And in depth, you know, it, it's all in the scripture based on uh, uh, a man finding out who he is in the Lord. Once he finds that out, you know, he can tap into a supernatural opportunity to serve Jesus to the fullness of his capacity and to see so many things come about in his life that just awesomely blows his mind based on uh, him being transformed by the renewing of his mind. You know, when a man's mind begin to be transformed, all the stinking thinking that he had once he was in a place of, of his own uh, livelihood it changes because then uh, he no longer belongs to himself he's been bought you know that's where redemption comes in we've been redeemed by the Lord and as you've been redeemed you bought back by a price the blood bought price that God has sent his only begotten son that whosoever believeth upon him should not perish that says it should not perish but that doesn't mean he won't because he's got to be able to focus himself upon the reality of growing in the understanding of his calling and his purpose. So that's just a brief understanding. Of, that's my heart desire. Not to be so much to develop a business that grows and I have so much money that I can't uh, begin to understand where I'm going to spend it, but just to be able to see the changes of lives from an understanding that if you trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not to your own understanding, he will direct your path. And your path will be on a journey that you've never encountered before, ever possible. 
but he will carry you to a higher planes and greater depths. And God's just so awesome. And I just praise you, the Lord, this day. Oh, this is the day that the Lord has made, and I will rejoice and be glad in it. And on this day, it is uh, December the 31st, 2007, year of our Lord. We're going into the year of 2008, and that year will be in the year of new beginnings. So I challenge any one of you that's watching this video, give me a call. I want to discuss some things about the Lord, discuss some things about your seeking God and is if you believe there is a God and all that, you know, I'm not in no debate or no argumental point, but I just want to share with you the liveliness of who he is and how he's changed my life and my family's life. And we are a people of, uh, that's just the Bible teaches you that we are strangers and foreigners just you know we're just passing through here here's a picture of my wife and I and that's me and her and uh, God is doing a wonderful work in and through us and enjoying our marriage believe it or not we've been married just December uh, excuse me just uh, November the, the 28th we was married 22 years believe it or not so get back in touch with us at 731-968-3174 or 731-234-1330. When you see this YouTube uh, and you think you might just want to just talk, not about business, but about who you are and, and who you're going and reaching to be and, and just some uh, comments about uh, life in general. I like to talk to you. So look forward to hearing from you. God bless you. I pray that he would add uh, greatness to your life in the sense of who he is because we can only be great through him you know it's not about what I do or what I can can do it's about the righteousness of God is in Christ Jesus see he became sin who knew no sin that I might be the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus and I am righteous because of him not because of what I do or what I put my hand to or how I do it but because of who he is so great to be praised is the Lord Keep in touch with me, and let's glorify the Lord, and we'll see what kind of connection we can make. I just want to make some connections with some of you out there. So get back with me. I look forward to hearing from you. God bless you. Look, look forward to knowing you and developing a long-term relationship with you. Bye for now.